yes guys so 2020 um it's been mad honestly it's been so mad but your girl yeah has just been you know like everyone else just dealing with it obviously the first few months was just lockdown and craziness and you know just mayhem basically um up until about let's say uh i would say maybe may june when things started to like calm down a little bit and they started lifting up some of the restrictions and now we're at a place where we can actually you know move with limitations with the masks and social distancing i don't know what everyone feels about that but drop your comments below basically i don't even i don't even know the whole social distancing thing for me is just like so hit and miss but anyway we moved and we got through it guys let's just even give ourselves a round of applause because we got through it it was mad it was emotional it was stressful um i don't know about you but i know people that actually contracted the mm -mm. and um yeah so you know we got through it guys we're alive we're well and we just have to give thanks um, so for me, it was just really locked down. I was still working, working quite hard, taking advantage of the situation and just stacking up the coins. So it got to my birthday in June. And I think by then things had started to improve. And I just, like a lot of people, I think I just took some time out to reflect on myself, my loved ones, um, my life in general i think for a lot of us it just really made us press that reset button and made us you know really start to kind of evaluate you know where we're at in life and many people might have lost people along the way so i think the whole reflection on life you know really kicked in for me personally it really did um i don't know about you guys but i put on a few pounds that lockdown period like your girl was going through the munchies and yeah the weight did really pile on top of the weight that was already there so i made um a decision to do some transformations um i've had a lot of issues with myself and although i'm quite a bubbly you know fairly confident person i felt like it was time to make some changes so coming up um for the next few videos i'm gonna like give you more details on basically the decision i made to have various procedures done so um in july a friend of mine a very close friend of mine went out to turkey and she did a weight loss um surgery which is known as the bariatric sleeve um for those of you that don't know what that is it's basically they cut away a portion quite a large portion of your stomach and then you're left with a smaller portion which means that you then are unable to eat large amounts of food you're only allowed to you're only able to eat, eat small amounts and therefore hence the weight loss so my friend successfully did the operation so come july now i'm contemplating that you know what the weight situation with me is just it just is i can't anymore like my knees were just caving in they were hurting i didn't have any energy in terms of like getting around just always tired and yeah i just decided to make the decision like my friend and i in in august i went out to turkey to do the weight loss surgery so i'm going to give you a little bit of footage of you know the journey and what I actually uh, did when I was out there. Um, yeah, so in August, I decided that was it, had enough. I'm gonna go and follow my friend's footsteps and go and do the weight loss surgery. So I went to Turkey um, and I went to my the, the hospital that my friend attended, which was the Hizar hospital in istanbul i'm going to leave all the links below all the details um and yeah guys basically i underwent weight loss surgery um what can i say um it was it was to be honest it was very pain free i didn't experience any any major pain i literally kind of to be fair sailed through the surgery 
I'm going to give you all the filler in the next video on the how it works, you know, what I've been able to achieve since then. Um, apart from that, so when I did the surgery, I decided also that I needed to sort out this area. So if you've watched my channel, my first channel or this channel, you know that, you know, the teeth situation wasn't quite on point. And for years, to be honest, I've not really been taking the best care of my teeth. So I thought whilst I'm in Turkey, I'm going to do my teeth as well. So, yeah, got the teeth done. Um, amazing, happy. It has really changed my outlook. I feel brand new. I just feel amazing. Um not only that, because <laughs> your girl yeah doesn't do things in half. So I also had a few um, skin issues. I suffer from keloids. Um, you can check out a video that I've done in the past on my other channel about keloids. But basically, for those who don't know, keloids are an overgrowth of the skin. Um, they come up in very um, big bumps. They can dominate your bodily and facial area in quite an unsightly way um for those of you that are returning and you know me you know you know basically what i had the issue i have with sorry my bracelet is making a lot of noise so whilst in turkey i decided to get them treated um i had them cut off lasered um i've just recently taken the plasters off because I've been in plasters for like about two and a half weeks. Um, so yes, guys, basically, your girl, Ya yeah, has been a very busy girl. But I think it's just been amazing. I cannot even like just begin to tell you how I feel about my transformations. Um, so if you want to know more about these weight loss surgery, Please check it out my next video after this one where I'm going to break it all down. I'm going to tell you the procedure. I'm going to tell you, you know, I'm going to give you some footage about, you know, where I did it, the journey, how I felt. Right now I'm feeling amazing. I cannot lie. I've literally lost about 12 kilos in weight in the space of like six weeks. Um, 12 kilos in weight is about a stone and a half which I think equates to probably about um, about 25 pounds in weight. Um, a lot of it has come off my face, I've been told. A lot of people are like, oh my God, your face looks so much slimmer. I really need it to come off, you know, the midriff area, etc. But it's a slow process. It's only been six weeks. It can take up to six months to a year for you to see like any kind of like major change um but it's all good it's coming off so that's what your girl yeah has been up to um so yeah that's my little update video i'm not going to make it too long but i will be doing more videos about the the whole transformation including the teeth etc etc but your girl is back I'm happy to be back in front of the camera. It's all good vibes, guys. It's all good vibes. Thank you for joining me. Please subscribe if you're new. Um, if you're a returnee, thank you. I'm going to put the notification bell um, up so that everybody can be notified when I get put up a new video. And like I said, so much to tell you guys. So please stay tuned. Thank you. Stay safe. Stay blessed. And... Peace out.